Motor Week is made possible by TireRack.com, Hum by Verizon, RockAuto.com, State Farm, AutoTempest.com, and WeatherTech. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week 92. We're glad to have you with us. The Saab 9000 is no stranger to the Motor Week stable. We have closely followed and brought you reports on the growing 9000 family. From the introduction of the angular, more conventional 9000 CD to the 9000 S with its typical Saab hatchback design. Plus Saabs with normally aspirated engines and turbocharged versions. They have all passed our way. Now there is a revised 9000 turbo with something special to get our attention. The five-door hatchback Saab 9000 Turbo has long been one of our favorite cars. It appeals to our desire for untraditional style and performance. There is little change to the 9000's looks. It's still aerodynamic, stylish, and uniquely Saab. And under the sloping hood, a more powerful engine. The two-liter turbo was replaced last year with this 2.3-liter 16-valve turbo version. It features an intercooler, cross-flow cylinder head, and counter-rotating balance shafts. Generating a whopping 200 horsepower and a fierce 244 pound-feet of torque, the powertrain establishes power quickly for a 0 to 60 time of 7.3 seconds. However, power peaks at only 5,000 RPM. The quarter mile takes 15.5 seconds with a final speed of 96 miles per hour. The big attention getter on the 1992 9000 Turbo is a standard traction control system. The all-speed system limits front wheel spin by modulating the throttle and brakes on cars with a manual transmission and throttle alone on automatic 9000s. Our car was a manual. The system works well and is very sensitive. It also works in reverse. Our only complaint is the system cannot be turned off for pure performance driving. Producing only mild push, the full-size Saab 9000 Turbo zips through transitions with the feel of a smaller car, a reminder that the Saab's McPherson underpinnings may be homesick for twisting European roads. What was felt was the traction control system engaging and disengaging, producing some power loss, but with little adverse effect on normal handling. Give some credit to the sticky Pirelli P750 series tires for excellent grip. The Saab 9000 Turbo includes large front ventilated disc brakes and anti-lock as standard. Stops from 60 miles per hour are straight and take an average, confidence-inspiring distance of 106 feet. The ABS provides good feedback, but there's more pedal pulsing than we'd like. EPA estimates fuel economy for the 9000 at 19 city and 26 highway. Ours covered 20 miles for every gallon of gas. As with the exterior, the interior has changed little from last year. It's still roomy and pleasing. Gauges are large and clear. And if you happen to live someplace really cold, like Sweden or Butte, Montana, you'll like the new freeze warning indicator. The steering wheel blocks some controls, but it does house a standard airbag. The leather-covered bucket seats are supportive. Power seat controls are standard. For 92, there is improved side crash protection and pretensioners for the seat belts. The automatic climate control system with its electrostatic air filter has too many buttons but is well positioned. Replacing the 80 watt Clarion stereo is a 150 watt version that includes a CD player. The sound quality is clear and powerful. There's plenty of family size room in the back. Head and leg room are good. To use the standard split folding seat back, the headrest must first be removed, a task that is easily accomplished. Including the trunk area, there is 56.5 cubic feet of usable cargo space behind the front seats. The base price for the 9000 Turbo with manual transmission is a hefty $36,945. A $920 four-speed automatic is about the only option. Thank goodness. We will always have a problem reconciling $37,000 for a four-cylinder car. And the addition of traction control did not make us go running for our checkbooks. Yet add turbo, a long list of amenities, and wrap it all up in a unique package like our old friend the Saab 9000, and you will definitely retain our attention over and over again. <laughs>